serve three main purposes. Main one being the bonding, which you see happening a lot of. And we use it for the entire grade six year. It, uh, our big question this year is looking at identity. And uh, the kids have come up with um, whether identity is static or ever changing. And so this is a great place to kick that off. I think there are a number of factors that make this park unique. The geology, this river valley actually is part of the Missouri system, so it's different from the other basins, the other river basins in Alberta. So that uniqueness, the fact that we have this water flowing by us here, that we can see heading to the Gulf of Mexico, means that we have different animal and plant species here that you might not find elsewhere. So seeing this is definitely nice for me because it shows me that they've actually taken some of this, what I've taught them and done more research and to make something like this is really awesome. I was talking to you ladies about how some of these kids finally get, they find that special spot and they can start to, they get comfortable with themselves and taking and asking those questions, who am I and what's my place in the world and, you know, uh, really truly making that connection to the land and then the connections with their friends and then bringing it back here. Yeah, academics is secondary, I mean it ties in beautifully and I could go into the curriculum part but no it's it's more than that person but also working at the park I can see the impact that my teaching of my culture to the kids has affected them and to see that is something that's very fulfilling to me because it helps break down those stereotypes and it helps children see my culture and its uniqueness and it's very satisfying as a Blackfoot person to see these kids bringing home some of the teachings that I've, I've taught them. And one thing that's really important to me is uh, being here and them putting their hand to their heart and saying hey, because that is something that's very important for when we get something uh, that's important from somebody. And so that shows me that they appreciate the information that I've given them. I spoke with one of the mothers here this afternoon who made a point of telling me that her son has spent a lot of time out in nature and she always figured or considered him a nature child because they've hiked in the mountains and that sort of thing. But his trip to writing on stone touched him in a way that she's never seen before. 